da, da, da. It's a ringing. It's a ringing. Let's see here. Hey, what's up? Yo, black man. How you doing? Well, um, right now I'm dipping. Remember, I told you that uh, that exotic, you know, with the weird, the, the whatever tea bag that has the licorice and uh, ginger in it. I have that. Yeah. And then you know what else I got? I'm gonna tell you what I got. I'm a. I, let, let, me, let, let me let me tell you what I. Got. I give you two guesses, and the first one don't count. What do you think I got? Come on now. Okay, I'll give you a hint. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. okay, you said you got, you have a second thing. Yes, right? I have a second drinking? thing. This way. It's a T. I'll, I'll give you that hint. It's a T. Oh, it's a T. Okay, because I, I had already started going into the juice area. <laughs> <laughs> no, when I, when I talk to you, it's the evening. So I, I drink my teas in the evening. But, you know, go ahead. Okay. okay. Got you. What do you think I got? Right. Come on, come on. So now you already said the Egyptian licorice, right? Yeah, no, 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 no. I didn't. I this one, the one I put in is that exotic one that has the is the is the uh, licorice and ginger. That that the oh, okay. I tell you that that mesh tea bag that they give you, you know, is you know yeah. expensive, you know. Da, 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 da. Well, why are you thinking? Look, hurry up, man! This is like a the, the, tick tock, tick tock. The clock is ticking. <laughs> You know. Okay, it has to have something with turmeric in it. <laughs> <laughs> you, 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 keep going. I'm not going to give you no other hints. I didn't told you a hint. It's, know what it's, okay. it's a it's a T. It's a T. Let me put it that way. Let me see if I can give right. you another hint. It it has. Let me put it. It has. Okay, I'll give you the biggest hint I can. It has eucalyptus in it. Ah. Oh gosh. You need a third. Okay. Go ahead. What okay. So, so what are you drinking some throat coat? Ah, throat. that's right. Now, how, how, how did I find out about throat coat? Oh, yeah, yeah. The brother told you. The brother told you. That's right. It's, uh, it supports throat and respiratory health. Eucalyptus one. But this that's is right. Like, and what else? What else? Doesn't it have a... It has a... Uh, it supports... Da, 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 da. Oh, no. I thought... I actually thought it had... Um, what's the name in it? I actually thought it had... Uh, licorice in it, but it doesn't. It just has it's eucalyptus. Okay. Yeah. So, so, so now, does, does that one also have the slippery elm in there, though? It says soothing, support, throat, health, respiratory, taste, plant story. Um, it doesn't seem like it seems like it just has eucalyptus. That's it. Okay, so you have the eucalyptus version. The oh. version that I, I sent you is the one with slippery elm. Oh, I did... I did. Excuse me. I messed up. I didn't look at the. Um, I didn't look at the at the post closely enough. I just saw a throat coat, and that was all. And when I went to the health food store again here in Missouri, it was there. You know, I just saw this. Oh, throat coat. I know that, and I just picked it up. That's what I yeah, get for that. They have a few of them. Yeah, go ahead. So, so you got the good respiratory one. But mm -hmm. the one that like coats the throat in the esophagus mm -hmm. is the one with slippery elm. Wow. Okay, I'm gonna you know now now look at that. Now I got to go find some health food store that got that in there. But in this one of this tea, now I gotta let it. It now here's the weird thing. It says it says uh, what does it say here? Uh, enjoy. Pour eight ounces of freshly boiled water into over tea bag. Cover. Cup and steep for ten to fifteen minutes. What the hell? I don't need steep. Foot. Okay, now I'm, I'm putting I'm putting a coast over it. My my friend here is into Diana Ross, so I got a Diana Ross. Uh, 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 what do you call that? Um, what do you call those things? Coaster, and I'm putting that over the thing. So I'm fogging up Diana Ross. I guess you know, boiling her. <laughs> I've been I've been I let him know because you know he a Diana Ross fanatic. Me. <laughs> Me, I, I'm into, you know who I'm into. I'm, I'm shucks. I'm, I'm into a lot of women, but in that era, that, that, that you give me some uh, Valerie Simpson any day, okay? Yeah, so yeah. So look, man, hey, we got some stuff to talk about, I suppose, but what's, 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 what's in your world, man? What's happening in New York? Is the fear going down? I hate it. I hate it. The hospitals are back to normal or less than whatever. You know, is the, the body bags are not pouring in anymore. The refrigerator trucks are going. What's going on in New York? Well, now, right now, it's almost like a, a lull. Mm. And the lull 
is coming from things are getting better, mm. but the the fear is slowly mounting because we're getting closer to the beginning of the school session mm. in New York. Public schools are going to be open, and are they ready, and are they prepared? Wow, you know, I, re- I left New York because of that fear level. I'm sorry, I left New York because of that fear level. But now, I, I would fear for the children because now they're saying that, forget that it's just, uh, uh, you know, dealing with, you know, boomers or, 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 or elders. They say it's going through everybody now. You know what I mean? Yeah. And here's the... And see, the thing is, is that the children, you know, they may not be fully affected, but they could be carriers. So they come home, or they come see grandma, if grandma or grandpa got to pick them up, or whoever, it's just going to keep going. <laughs> well, here's the funny, he's not the funny, but the other I mean, thing this. And, and that's my fear, personally. That's mine. So I don't uh, know if it's going to happen, but, you know, if, if I was to, like, map it out mm. mentally, how things happen, mm. and you think, okay, if the kids, if they put the kids back in school and they don't do their due diligence in making sure everything is clean and stuff like that, and then the kids, they start playing or they're not disciplined enough to wear masks and stuff like that because, you know, they're children, you know, and the natural thing is to touch. The natural thing is to, you know, breathe freely. The natural thing is to engage with others. That's that's what kids do. That's what they do. So, that's yeah. what they do. You know, I, I saw the latest issue or the, I should say, the July issue of Rolling Stone magazine. They had in France, they have the kids outside, but in these squares, the kids got to stay in their squares. That This is like wild to me. They talk yeah, about social yeah. engineering. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, wow. squares, circles, all of that. Mm-mm. In fact, I, I was even thinking like, when, when this whole thing is over, think about it. Let's say this thing goes... Until 2022. Ooh, no, stop. Oh, no, hold on. Stop, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm going to go with the official projections. This was 18 months from the... Oh, right, that is 2022. Okay, I take it back. Go ahead. Allow, let's get back to what I was saying. Yes. Let's say this thing goes to 2022. By 2022, you'll be so used to wearing a mask, you won't even take it off when they say, oh, we're good now. Now, but here's the thing about the the problem is this because now they're doing they're doing autopsy and they say this thing is going because you know what goes it goes in through the nose goes to you know throat whatever it goes down to your lungs right but then it goes straight from it to the brain because that's where flus work and so it goes to the brain and when it goes to the rest of the body you know through the spinal cord or whatever have you but the problem is is that they're finding that when they're doing these autopsies now that the condition of the brain is like jacked up you know. Yeah. And so even if you survive whatever have you, what's it doing to your brain? And this is science. I'm not talking about, you know, politicians talking or the or middlemen like, you know, the the the, 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 the middle, you know, the, the what do I call these? The administrators that have doctor's degrees talking. I'm not talking about I'm talking about real scientists saying this stuff. Yeah. So yeah. I you know, I trust the scientists. I don't I don't I don't listen to everybody been listening to what they have these daily things from whoever the politicians, whatever governor it is. Why are you listening yeah. to these people? Do they have medical degrees? No. <laughs> oh, oh, wait a second. Hold on. Now here's now. The, okay, you have the you have that right. There's other yeah. things that I just got a report in Africa. As you know, Mister Eugenics himself, Mister Mister from a long line of eugenics himself. Yeah. Uh, we, we're talking about your your boy. You know, I'm saying your boy because you're you're a computer person. Your boy, Billy the Gates, <laughs> Billy the Gates and his foundation. Yeah. They're, they're you know they they come to just trying to work. they're going to come up with a with a with a with a what do you call it a, a shot whatever they call those things a vaccine right? Yeah. Well, do you want to take a guess? And I only get and, and and I'll give you two. I'll give you I give you three chances, but the first two don't count. You want to guess who they're testing this? You know, whenever they come up with this virus, well, this this immune thing, whatever they're calling it, we want to guess who they're testing. Um, I don't know, sweets. <laughs> <laughs> if only, if only, 
you know, the first thing, in fact, this thing is rolled out already. They, they had this plan in place already in, in partnership with the Bill Gates Foundation. I think it's um, a MasterCard and some other shady, whatever have you. They're testing West Africans, Nigerians. Well, West Africa? Oh, yes, they're going to no. start with they're, they're going to start with Nigeria. Well, West Africa. They're going to start with Nigerians, and you know, and you know, he, she, 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 meaning Melinda Gates, also has said that. Oh no, they're going to they're going to give the they're going to give the virus rather they're going to give this uh, this uh, um, whatever. I'm, I'm, you know what I'm talking about? The, the shot. They're going to first yeah. give it to to poor black people because you know they need it first. So in the United States, it's going to be poor black people, and they're testing this stuff in Africa right now. Not only Africa, the rural areas. Wow. The rural areas. Now, if people don't know about Africa, let me tell you what happens, right? You might be in a rural area, but usually you have some sort of, re you have some sort of relative in the city because if you have to go to some, some legal thing, whatever have you, you go to the city. So you might be living in a rural area, but if you have to go to the city for whatever you have to go to it for some legal thing, then you'll go to the city. So look, my point is this. Do you trust Billy the Gates? Do you trust Melinda? The, uh, Billy the Gates, who, who comes from a line of, but his father as well as his grandfather started with, was with the eugenics movement. He's a eugenicist, right? And yeah. folks, folks, people don't know what eugenicist is. Those are the people who don't think that you're human. The yeah, certain yeah. people don't think they're human. Okay, we won't exactly. get into all that right now. And do you know, you know Melinda Gates? You know her, her lineage goes to here we go. The Fed, the Fed. You know the people that make the fake money, the fiat money. <laughs> fiat. So you got the two one two punch. How? Yeah. Here's my problem. How do people not know this? Yeah, I know. Right? How do people? My my problem is this. Look. This could have been like like when Billy's when when, when Billy the Gates's father, you know, or even say grandfather was around. No, the news wasn't out. They could do all kinds of things. You wouldn't you wouldn't find out till like twenty years later, you know. But now yeah. it's right there in your face. Hey, don't you forget research? Forget reading? Don't you browse the internet? <laughs> exactly. Seriously, my my whole thing is throughout this whole thing, I'm like. If all this stuff is happening, what if we didn't have the internet? What if, if that was taken away? Well, you know, they shut down. They shut down YouTube on a number of people for a number of reasons, right? That's why yeah. I have I have a backup. You know, I have BitChute as my backup. In other words, everything that goes on my YouTube channel automatically BitChute picks it up. Now, BitChute, as long as there's another, there's other platforms also. I forgot the other. There's a, a couple of other platforms that are decentralized. And that's what you want. You want a decentralized platform where somebody can't flip the switch, you know? Yeah. Yeah. So so I advise everybody, no matter what, you know, we're, we're, we're doing this right now. But as soon as I finish, I put this up right away and it goes to BitChute. I got to find another one to go to also, you know, as I settle down and get into this brave new world, you know, I'm talking about electronic world. Because as you know, we're doing this, we're doing this. We're doing this the, the the funky way, you know. I have you on one phone with the with the with the uh, what do you call it with the um, with the audio, right? And yeah. then you, I'm on I'm on camera, you know. So people only getting to look at my lovely face, you think? <laughs> but they <laughs> but they but they hear your great voice. So there you go, you know. But I want it that way because I got to keep my sources because the people I for this setting, you know, the people I'm interviewing, I don't want people to know you. I don't want people to be able to, to identify you, you know? And so I only have a few people. Uh, I have uh, you, John Kane, who's American Indian. I have Grayson, who you know, Grayson, Grayson Chandra, who well, I say is a genius. And I have one more person coming, my my, my uh, South African guy. I'm going to get on. I'm going to get on, too. I just, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get him on, too. So, man, and he's, he's a South African youth. When I say youth, this boy, let me put it this way. You know, you know how I am, right? You just, you, um, when I say you know how I am, just think of me, even back in the day when I first met y'all, you know how radical I am. Well, this guy, he's like, like he's what, he's like, what, he was 25 when I met him. So he's about 30 now, 31, whatever have you. This guy is more radical than I was at 25. Wow. I mean, talk on every level, talking about uh, religious, well, you know, whatever, you know, church, whatever that, that we're talking about community organizing. He organizes. In fact, he's 
Oh man, I wait, I wait. We, you'll sooner or later I'll get him on thing. He'll talk about what's happening in in in, in South Africa, and if particularly he's he's in the rural area. He works with the villages. He organizes he organizes the kids, the you know the the the, the kids that are, that are trying to be criminals. He sits down and talk to them, and say, "Yo, you can't do this." Blah blah. blah. Oh, it's it's amazing. This cat's unbelievable. So when I, I'm bringing this whole up thing to say this, everybody thinks that they are the it. And I keep on telling people, even me, I mean, okay, I've had certain whatever, whatever, success, bona fides, whatever you want to call it. But I've, oh, and, and I might even say because I'm a radio person, I might even, you know, try to, you know, tell you that I'm, I'm the baddest dude on the planet, whatever have you. But I know from traveling, just there's me. And guess what? There's a lot of other people like me. Yeah. That's what they don't understand. They think they they can just they they can just take out a Malcolm or or or, or, or you know or, or take out a, 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 um, whoever they think they're going to take out. That person already that person you know has their has another person that's even better than they are. Yeah, and I don't think the the, the, the dominant system, whatever you want, because they they don't understand that. I mean, I know some Africans that are like, man, talk about I I know some Indians, I know some whatever. You know, Sri Lankans. Yeah. <laughs> I know some just some Senegalese. <laughs> so anyway, I don't want to go off on that. Uh, so anyway, so what's 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 going on in the real world, man? What else is happening, man? Ah, oh, man. Well, I was just gonna go back to the whole school thing because oh, that's yeah. to me that's crazy. That yeah. that is is you know to me. The, the school, and, and the reason why I brought up the school thing is that it's not just school. It's like just systems in place. Yeah. And the systems in place, they just seem that either, you know, they got it already, you know, set up and they're sort of like, you know, kind of playing with you. Like, oh, yeah, we don't know what we're going to do. We're probably going to do this and do that. Or they really don't know. Well, I think it's a bit of both. Of, no, it's a it's a lot of one thing and a bit of another thing. Just to, and yeah. the, the bit of it, another thing is just to cover their behinds. Let's put it that way. Yeah. But like, when is I, it a bacon switch or is it like nah? We, you know, it's it's, uh, it's, it's, it's I'm saying what we're doing. <laughs> I'm saying it's all of that. But here's the thing: what I learned yeah. from you remember I'm I'm a, I'm a working media whatever have you. One time I was working uh, dealing something with NBC, and what I learned from them is that say for instance it was well, this is back then if they're going to put on a new news program right there's going to be a whole yeah. new news program they will spend a year they will get the camera people they put everybody in place to mock sets even this real sets together and they will practice on that set for months and months and months before they unveil that new program so you think it's brand spanking new and they just thought it up last week or whatever have it but they've been working on that for a long time you know yeah you know they did that in um there was a, a show called the morning show on apple tv plus mm -hmm. and they showed that they showed them rehearsing 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 until they debuted the show and they just that's kept it. you know just rehearsing it out just you know that's what they do banging it out yeah it's a it's it's an intricate dance, but more importantly, you you okay, you saw that. That's what I'm trying to say. And once if they do that with just the media, think what happens. All the testing they got to do with this and that and whatever have you. You know what I mean? And who are they going to test on? They're going to test on people that they can hoodwink you into thinking need to need to be tested upon. Yeah. You know. Yeah. You know, and, and the, the the upsetting thing to me though really has to do. The upsetting thing, look, this has, the, everything that's happening, the only thing going to stop this is people have got to have some sort of solidarity. And I don't want to say it this way, I don't know whatever, word, but be revolutionary minded. That's all. You know, like, yeah. oh, you happen in New York. Remember when they, when they had the bus drivers, you may, just the transit system, they had the bus drivers, they wanted to, they wanted to lock people up, but they wanted the bus drivers to, to, to take the people in the buses to jail or whatever. And the bus drivers say, hey, we ain't doing that. And yeah. they couldn't do that. Yeah. Tell me about that. How did that happen? What, what, what's the mentality of the bus driver? You, you were in that, you was in that system. You know these people. Oh, well, the whole thing is that, first of all, it's like, you have the, the, management telling you what you have to do mm -hmm. then you're looking at well well what does my union say about this is this right to do because 
first of all, you have your own consciousness of, I don't think that's right. Or, and also you think about your own safety, like, nah, who's going to defend me? You know, if I'm attacked. Then you have, well, I wouldn't want this happening to my family. So you start thinking on that level. Then finally, you're just like, you know what? Don't even pay me enough for this. I'm not doing this. <laughs> Mm-hmm. So then it just becomes, you know, a, a battle of wills at that point. But, you know, they've done so many things over the years. It's been crazy, you know, where they've threatened, you know, well, we're going to put you in jail. We're going to charge you, find you a thousand dollars if you go on strike, anything like that for a day and stuff. So, you know, you kind of, at least I've learned to, you, you have to play it by ear. You know, you have to play the situation. You, you have to really analyze the situation for what it is. And then you just go with the bottom line of how you feel about it, which is usually, in most cases, like, no, nah, this is wrong. Or, no, the, you know, nobody's got my back. Or, no, this can actually harm me. And no one else will care. So I'm not going to do it. Mm. 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 Well, let me put it this way. It, it seems like they think... When I say they, the 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 uh, you know air quotes they, you know the powers that be, whatever you call, it, they actually, I think they actually believe. I think they live like like maybe forty years ago or something like that. They actually think the stuff that they've been doing back then is going to continue to work. Yeah. No. It's, well, basically, they they have this thing of we're so disconnected from where you are. And what you do and how you live, we're just going to tell you what to do and, and just use our um, our system to force you to do it. And, you know, most people, because of either fear or because they just, you know, don't want to be bothered or because of their ignorance, they comply. So they're like, oh, well, we got 80 percent of them. It's that 20 percent of, you know, troublemakers. <laughs> Who we got to deal with? But 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 is the, is that changing? I guess I'm I'm asking you. I'm I'm asking you as act basically as a New Yorker because oh, nah know. nah nah they run that play until it can't be run anymore. You know what I'm saying? We're talking like the Green Bay Packers back in the day of when they when they had Super Bowl one or something. It's like we're gonna run that running play, you know, sweep right, <laughs> and we're gonna keep running it until they stop us. Hmm. Ah. Uh, that's what I'm trying to get at. To they stop us. We are the they stopping the, again, again, air quotes, them. Now, there is the thing, but remember their ages, that's my point. They, they have to have a force in between us to do that. Now, up until now, it's been, it's been the police, whatever it is, you know. Right. And then now, now if they try to bring in the National Guard or something like that, of course, the National Guard, that's your, that's people that's in your neighborhood, you know what I mean? So, yeah, yeah. so, 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 so the biggest fear is just like what happened with that that Kosovo Sarajevo, you know, when 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 Bubba was in charge, and those people said, "Hey, Moshe Vek, whoever is there, hey, the guards stood down and said, no, oh, yeah, we don't care, no, whatever." The guards, and not they were on their side, they just didn't do nothing. Well, the people going to yeah. do what they do, and the same thing happened in another country just now. I think the same kind of area, the Serbs or something like that. Well, you don't mess with yeah. the Serbs, but they they crazy. Yeah, the Serbs said that they they are in solidarity with Black Lives Matter. Mm. They said that inspires them. Mm. Now, so it said that. I saw it on TV. That's something. And I'm talking about on the regular channels showed it. You know what I mean? Oof. You know, not not nothing, you know, where it's like, oh, well, this station's a little radical or something. No, no, this is like the, the standard branch showed it. Mm. <laughs> I gotta get rid of this guy. I gotta get rid of this brother. I have to call him back. Sorry about that. Let me turn my uh, no problem. And my thing. You heard you. You heard my ringtone. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Mayday. I should let it go to Mayday so you can hear. It, so you know. You know. Because <laughs> this is an emergency situation. Actually, Mayday. Um, I want to bring up, I think, you know, we, we I don't want to be on here long. You know, usually we, I talk to you like, you know, maybe 40 minutes or something. Like that. I don't want to be on here too long. But I have to bring up one more thing because this is really, really bothering me. Uh, because I'm in this area right now where, like, like for instance, they, people, all they do is listen to NPR. You know what I mean? Yeah. And, you know, and, and those those kind of things. 
um, that that's for radio. I don't know what people look at the TV. Maybe they're looking at MSNBC, whoever they're looking at. And so, you know, they got this, we got to get rid of Trump. We got to get rid of Trump. And I'm looking at these people. I say, okay, you got to get rid of Trump. I mean, I, I wouldn't have nothing to do with him being there in the first place. But wait a second. So you're going to vote for who? Look, when Trump, for instance, I'll give you a better, somebody brought this up. When Trump was putting that uh, that article in the New York Times talking about the, 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 five, the five brothers need to be, uh, 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 um, with capital punishment, need to be executed. That's what he right. put, they put, then you remember that back in the 80s, whatever, that back yeah. with, with, the, with the whole wilding thing. The whole and then, yeah. Well, at the same time we was doing that, no, this was the 90s, was it the 90s? Well, whenever it was. Well, at the same time, Biden was doing the, the, his little uh, uh, bill. You know what I mean? He was, yeah. in other words, he was actually locking brothers up. Trump was saying lock them up and kill them. He was actually locking them up. He was, Biden was actually putting laws in place to lock them up and actually kill them. Yeah. You know, they're, they're just just now they had this whole thing with Trump. You know, he wanted to go, go, you know, pull down the Afghan water, whatever it is. Hey, get, get out of here. And both the Democrats and the Republicans said, no, we're going to stay in Afghanistan. All I'm trying to say, I'm, look, I'm not doing the Trump thing, okay? I'm not saying that. All I'm trying to say is, and now they want to put Biden in there. Biden has done more damage than Trump could ever do. And it's amazing to me. These people say, got to get rid of Trump because he's crazy, blah, blah, blah. Let me say, uh, do you understand what, what you're talking about? Biden is the worst. Yeah, I look at it like this, is that you got like a combination of two. It's like, you, there's no winning. Do you understand? Nope. It's, it's a stalemate and a checkmate at the same time. Whoa. Wait a second. Repeat that again, because I'm not a big chess player, but tell me what this is again. That's, that's, that's best more than that's chess and war. Go to, tell me what chess is. Yeah. But, but tell, what, what did you just say? Okay. When, when you're playing a board game and nobody can win, mm -hmm. it's a stalemate. Mm -hmm. And then when obviously you, def you finally defeat the person, it's checkmate. Mm hmm so I'm saying it's checkmate and stalemate at the same time. One, two, punch. Oh, no. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Wow. Unbelievable. But anyway, so my, my point is, so, 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 so my friend, he won't even talk to me about Trump. Cause I, in fact, oh, let me tell you something. Wait, I walk the dog every morning. And I, there's this guy that has his Trump flag out there. You know what I mean? And I started yeah. talking to him the other day, right? And I talked to him again. I'm talking to this boy. You know, he's an older man. You know, he's old, whatever. You know, I, I, I love talking to old people. Yeah, I don't, The young people I don't talk to because they just want to argue. And man, I'm going like, he was saying some stuff to him, some, some Trump lines with her. Then I talked to him, I talked to him. And he says, oh, you know, you, I think we've come to an understanding. I agree with what you're saying, blah, 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 blah. That's the problem. You, if you get a one-on-one -on -one Trump person and you start talking to logically, I'm not talking about this old passionate like, oh, Trump, but then all of a sudden you understand that the positions, you know, you know, you're not far apart. But people don't want to talk. I'm not. I'm, let me leave it. Let me leave that because I'm. Gonna, I'm gonna interview him sometime. I'm gonna put him up on on the channel. You'll 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 see it sooner or later. But here's the here's the thing, man. I'm saying folks are brainwashed. Again, when I tell them, when I when I told my friend, I'm not voting for I'm not voting for Biden. You know what I mean? And he says, Well, that means you give your vote to Trump. I said, I'm not voting for Trump either. But that means that Trump what we gotta get rid of Trump. I said, No. I said, I'm voting up top because remember, I'm I'm ADOS. I'm writing in. I, in fact, I think Virginia might be a swing state where I vote. I'm still writing up top because I don't, why am I going to, it's my vote. Well, I'm not going to compromise my principles because you have some fear in your heart. You fear this person more than you fear this person who actually does. You fear this person more than you fear this damaged person who, who won't even give you, what, 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 won't give, what, forget, look, he won't give you, he won't give you health care in a pandemic. He already said that. <laughs> He, he, you know, they're talking about the Democratic Party <laughs> head by him, right? He's not going to get yeah. the whole marijuana. Thing. He's got to study marijuana more. Okay, fine. We, whatever you're going to say that. He's not going to give you know all those things. He, he keeps on sending your people to war. I mean, unbelievable. All this stuff. You know, this <laughs> he's done more damage than Trump could ever do. It, just in his record. Forget. With everything, with everything else, and he's still going to be yeah. beholden to Wall Street. And <laughs> not, just not like to interrupt you, boss. 
that's something that's been on my mind, like an internal battle going on in my mind too, but exactly what you're saying, which is, is it the current record or the past record or is the record the record? You know what I mean? I hear you, man. You can it's explain like, it further because you know, you know, this is for the five or six people that listen to, to listen to this YouTube channel. Maybe they need to know, man. Go explain it further if you want. I'm saying the the record is the record, right? So people go, well, Trump has a record of this, this, and this, and this, and it's like, well, Biden has a record of this, this, and this, and this. But it seems like some people kind of look like, yeah, well, that's in the past, and we kind of, you know, survived that or or thrive through it or whatever. <laughs> and, but we got to do this now. <laughs> it's like, oh, yeah. well, wait a minute. But it's still like the record, though. The record is the record. A leopard does not change its spots. I mean, even even a black leopard, they realize that even a black leopard has spots. <laughs> yeah. It's a leopard. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> I believe they call them panthers, right? <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, so so that's it. So my thing is like I'm I'm, I'm voting. I'm, I gotta vote because I love to vote. I'm, I'm an old 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 school voter, man. I was back when the, when they had the New York machines, but they had that that lever. I love that thing. That lever they used to have. Oh yeah, me too. Yeah. I love that, man. That's when I started. I love that. Now they got the computers. Turn that little lever that dial to the left. Yep. It's clicking it down. It's like cool. And then you put you put that thing. You go whoosh. That was so good. They opened and, the curtain at the same time. And also. Those machines had a certain smell to them. Ah. Like, it just smelled like politics. Like, there's some serious <laughs> politics going on here. And when yes. you pull, like you said, when you pull that red lever to close the curtain, it's like, yeah, now it's just me. You know, now I can do whatever I want here. I can write it whoever I want. I can do whoever I want. But then when you open it up, it's like, it's none of your business what I did. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So here, so so anyway, so I want to say, so I'm I'm voting. Look, look, you can't even change. I don't care who he, I don't care who Biden has has vice president because you know they, yeah. I don't care. I, you can't even yeah. name a person. You name you can't name a person. Whoever he puts in, even even if it's Tammy Duckworth, who's a veteran, you know what I mean. I would maybe yeah. go for that. No, I ain't going for it because I'm not going for that game. This is a time for revolution. So I'm writing in. A D O S. Now I'll, I'll look down ballot see if they have it. If they, if they get it, and every time they have a corporate Democrat, something like that, I'm saying I'm not giving this boy any support either. I'm right. I might do the whole thing A D O S. You know why? Because that gets recorded. That's a real survey. When they when they take surveys, well, the real survey is what you do in the voting booth. If they see a bunch of A D O S in the voting booth, they're gonna say, "What's this A D O S? What's going on here? What's what? Who's that? Who? I want to I want to spin their heads. You know? Don't get me wrong. This is my vote. This is the way I think. I'm not trying to make everybody else do the same thing. I, when I used to, um, when I was working, and we would have to vote for like union president, mm -hmm. I was exactly the same way. It was exactly the same. I always voted with the radicals. Even when it cost me something, and it did one time, they wanted me to vote for, for the, you know, the status quo. And they were going to help me with um, with uh, a problem that I had. Ooh. And I voted against them anyway. Ooh. <laughs> I voted against them anyway. See? And of course, they didn't help me. But I was like, nope. I'm too principled. I can't vote for you. You just I said can't. it. You just said it. Black man, let me tell you something. I have been so fortunate because most of my life, I have been surrounded by principled people. I think yeah. you, you are who you surround yourself with. If you're going to yeah. go with the status quo, if you're going to keep on listening to the same broadcast all the time, the same, you know, the voices all the time, even if you, I don't care if it's, whether it's Fox and whatever, I don't even bring up any things, then you're going to become that because that's in your yeah. head. Man, yeah. you know, give me some Max Kaiser, give me some Yvette Cornell, give, 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 give me some, you know, give me some Jimmy Dore, you know what I mean? Yeah. I, I love Jimmy Dore. That, that, that's my Tone man. Talks. Tone talks. Tone talks. Uh, uh, hey, man. Antonio <laughs> Moore. Antonio Moore. Give me some of that. You know what I mean? I haven't been listening to uh, um, uh, Dr. Cobb does this thing with this sister. Uh, what's her name? Uh, Karen something? I mean, I, I, I've been listening to that Are you lately. Karen, Karen Hunter on Serious XM? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, that, that's her name. Yeah, yeah. 
Oh yeah, I've been checking out Cameron Hunter for a while now. Yeah, but every it's Friday, like, five does like a like yeah. history class. That's right. That's it. That's yeah. it. You know. Yeah. I, I guess we better talk about that for a second. You know, what I mean, then we can end it there. But we have to talk about Nick Cannon. You know. Oh uh, yeah, man. Well, to me, it's like you know, I, I saw a clip on Instagram where he was where he was talking with Professor Griff. Yep. And I was like, oh, okay, so I know what this is. Now, mind you, up until then, all I saw was just a clip when I was visiting my mom's and I saw like on E.T. that uh, Viacom fired him. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, you know, they, you know, took a clip out of it mm -hmm. to obviously disparage him. Mm -hmm. So I was like, oh, okay, I'll find out what happens later. Mm -hmm. Then I, didn't, I just forgot about it. And the next day, today, I look and I see like a little Instagram post and I see just the clip which obviously this is what they probably, you know, got him for. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, oh, okay, here we go. So it, it just goes back to the same thing. I mean, is this 2020 or is this is like 1985, 86, 87, 88 or something like that? It's the same thing. But you know what happens? They've been monitoring him, you know, because remember, I think he had Riz Islam on, he had Farrakhan on, and then he has Professor Griff on, you know? So, yeah, no, but even, even more so, He's been um, embracing the Moorish culture more oh. and more. No, that's right. Okay. Well, there you go. No, definitely. You know, to me, it was like, it's inevitable. Oh, of course. Of course. Yeah. See, because he's young, he just doesn't, yo, man, all you got to do, all you had to do is just stay with Cobb, you know? Like, you, you, okay, remember I had no more radio. Who was my guy? Was you know I could I could have had I could have had a letter Jeffries I could have had a bunch of things but my guy was James Small. Yeah. He he was the historian the philosopher for No More Radio. Yeah. I picked him for a reason because I yeah. know he knows everything but he knows how to do it. He he yeah he's 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 hanging out with with Scobie Professor you know with Scobie and and, and all them people you know what I mean. Yeah. I've advanced yeah. cinema all them people. I'm hanging out there every you know with, with you know the, uh, First World Alliance. But out of all those people, to me, the person was to get James Small. That's yeah. why he was with. That's why I run with him. I don't run with those other people. But he, but he knows how to say it. He knows how to how to do it. I'm not trying to say um, what's name said it wrong. People say he he should have said it wrong. Ah, but you know, know who you're dealing with. You know. Yeah. yeah. And you. I remember um, back in the day, um, you set it up for me to record um, Dr. Ivan Van Sertema. Exactly. And after listening to him, and you know, editing it and putting it on the show and stuff like that, I was like, okay, see. When, when you go on that level, it's on a level like it wasn't like um and and you know much respect to and and uh, peace to all the elders like um John Henry Clark and um Doctor Ben Doctor Ben yeah well actually actually the, the, the other person I really man, love is like, Amos no I'm sorry let me let me just but the other person I really love is Amos Wilson that's again my man I didn't have more yeah. I, I would have oh, yeah. taste of him Amos Wilson yeah no joke no mm -hmm. joke. Mm. Okay, what, like what, what, when we had Ivan Van Sertima, when I was listening to him, I was like, "Well, <laughs> they could question him all they want, but he's got so many tools in the toolbox, you know." <laughs> yeah, you know? that's it. Okay, so you know, you know, and then and then plus, you know, what I, I don't want to stay on him, but no, I have to say one more thing about the whole uh, Nick Cannon thing, and you know what they did. They got some rapper, I don't remember who this person is, some rapper from England, from England, from yeah. Britain, from the, you know, the, the the mother of the mother, comes on and and, and attacks and, and says says that Nick Cannon is being a black supremacist. That don't make <laughs> no sense. I mean, look, even if he wasn't listening to Mr. Neely Fuller Jr., you go like, Yo, you can't have you can't have two supremacists. Supremacy is supremacy. You can't you can't have white supremacy, and then have black supremacy. Which one is supreme? Come on, it's, it doesn't make any sense. There's only one supremacy. Exactly. Yeah, you know exactly. So, you know that's what supremacist means. You know, you know I'm the one on top. So if he if he's diametrically opposed to something to the system, he can't look. You you understand what I'm saying? Let yo man. Yeah. Um, let, 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 let's talk again next week. We'll have some other topics, I suppose, you know, 
I want to stop it here because, you know, people have short attention spans, even though this is historic. You know, this goes up, you know, like I said, I have, I have backups and all the rest of this goes up someplace else. And, um, you know, and of course, you can always get in share, man. When you when you get the thing, just share it with somebody, you know, say whatever, if you wish. You know, I can't tell people oh, okay. what to do, you know. OK, yeah. black man, I'll talk all to right. you. All right. OK. Later. Ladies. Later.